<laughs> he made it. <laughs> and with that, we welcome you into the Did I scare you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, the top hour of Sports Center AM alongside my frightened friend here, Jamie Sire, that's Serena Morales, and that's Kevin Agandi. I'm Jay Harris. Uh, it's 8 o'clock here on the East Coast. Coming up at 831, Tony Stewart and Marty Smith are on a boat, and they're going to join us live. That's all you Daytona. need. <laughs> that is what you call a tease. Um, at 844, Dan Lebatar joins us to talk about the comments that he had regarding Magic Johnson yesterday. Uh, Paul Pierce tweeted this out three hours ago. <clears throat> 73 wins, and you thought he was going to win. A, a big outburst from the offense. We're going to talk about that in a moment. Let's bring in Alvaro Martin as well as Bruce Bowen. Um, before we get to what the offense did in the third quarter, this guy he just gets underneath your skin, and it works. It works. Let's start, though. Was that a kick? Well, what did you see with Draymond when he hit the deck? Was, was that a kick? I didn't see a kick. Did you see a kick? <laughs> I didn't see a kick. Come on. The man. master of footwork <laughs> in the NBA. <laughs> you didn't yeah, see what? a kick. I didn't see a kick. You saw a hootie kick? Roll the video. He can't, he can't <laughs> get his foot in the air? He can't do that to get balance? <laughs> he was on the, he was ground. on the ground. Exactly. How do you get balance? He's trying to balance yourself on the ground. Especially. Especially. Well, one, I think he got away with one. You're the master at, at footwork <laughs> in the NBA, so. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just make that clear. Now, seriously now, yeah. he's got 11. He's on course to be suspended at the end mm. of the first. I tell by his hands, it, 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 you know, the pinching of the fingers. But, <laughs> no, it, it's, it's one of those deals where you got to let players be who they are because that's the reason why the, the Golden State Warriors play with an edge. You take Draymond off that, great, off that team, you have Steph Curry, who's a great guy. You have Kevin Durant, who's a – you just going to disrespect that man like that. He can't guard me, Bruce. Draymond Green guard. got to the NBA and became a star in the NBA by being the underdog and playing like the underdog. He's got to understand that now he's a top dog. He's an all-star. He's a key member of this team. If that won't be happening this season in Major League Baseball, as there will now be a dugout signal to indicate an intentional walk as part of a rule change this week. And to talk more about that, good to have MLB Commissioner Rob Manfred in the studio. Good to see you. Nice to see you as well. Um, so let's get right to it. You made two holes in one on the same <laughs> hole. That's true. No car. Oh, well. No car. All I got to do was buy drinks. That's, <laughs> that's, 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 that's what happens, right? That's right. Uh, let's get to the intentional walk rule here. Um, change this week, uh, the dugout signal, as Jay made a reference here, putting the runner on first base. Uh, when you look at the numbers, 932 intentional walks in, in 2,428 regular season games. Right. I know... Well, in extra innings, starting a runner on second base. Now, right. to, uh, talking to some of the players, uh, they have expressed some concern with this, especially the pitchers, saying that, you know, this could result in a loss very easily if you, if you got a bump, bunt or a sacrifice fly, also maybe some contract money. Um, how do you balance pace of play with some of these concerns that you're hearing from the players? Well... Let me start with things move along better. And, and I think one of the reasons for its durability is it is a constant reminder uh, to players that you have to move the game along. And, and that's, I think, very important. Let